<laughs> Yo, we talking about groceries on FBA. Yo, easy. <laughs> J to the O, the Mayos. Groceries on FBA. What you know about that? <laughs> Step your game up, suck it. Hey everybody, Sean Mayo here, and I just installed a brand new utility from Nate McAllister. Uh, it's for context searching uh, online, and uh, I'm not going to go through how to install it and all that. Uh, Nate made a great video on how to do that, but I'm going to show you how it works for me and what we're doing uh, to, uh, to help with our online sourcing. Uh, so there's a context search, and you can do it from... Uh, really anywhere you'd be searching you just only have to highlight uh, text and you'll be able to uh, search uh, anywhere you'd like uh, so Nate put a lot of work into uh, finding uh, the strings to uh, do these searches so you don't have to actually go to uh, all kinds of websites and I'm going to show you uh, an example uh, so uh, I'm just on the Amazon Movers and Shakers page right now, uh, and I just selected uh, the title of this Shopkin Sweetheart Collection, and you can right-click on it, and uh, if we go down to Context Menu Search, uh, now these are all the, um, the, some of the ones that are built in, but uh, all the strings that he's added, things for um, eBay, uh, eBay completed listings, um, uh, things like... Uh, Google image search, um, searching on Twitter, on Facebook, uh, on Amazon, YouTube, uh, even Craigslist. Uh, and we'll get into how we use Craigslist uh, a little bit later. Um, some little known sites like Upsy, uh, you can search on Camel, Camel, Camel. Uh, search Tempest, which is another uh, tool, um, which is actually a search engine for searching on Craigslist in many different locations. Walmart, Target, Kmart, um, and there's a lot more that um, we just don't use uh, ourselves, so um, I eliminated from this list, but uh, he has a lot more of them in there uh, as well. Uh, so if we just click on Walmart, it's going to search whatever you highlight uh, right on, uh, on Walmart. So uh, you don't have to copy that information uh, and then go to walmart.com and then put it in the search string and come up. Uh, all you have to do is select it, right click, uh, click on whatever uh, search you want to do, and uh, you find all the uh, other uh, information. And then if you're using OAX Ray, you know, it makes it even easier. So you find, uh, you know, a hot product, you right click on it, open up in, um, in Walmart, and then you can go into OAX Ray, uh, and it's going to uh, look all that information up for you. Um, real simple. This isn't about OAX Ray though, but uh, you know that's just a another option uh, to expand it even further. And it doesn't matter where you are, where you're searching, uh, if you're on uh, Amazon or Walmart.com or you know even on Facebook, you can search. Um, you know, those strings, all it needs is the information on the page. Uh, so as I said before, there is um, some great options for uh, searching on Craigslist, uh, not only your local Craigslist, uh, but with a site called Search Tempest, uh, which Nate's included in here. Uh, I've gone to uh, um, search for Lego, so uh, if you're looking for uh, things on Craigslist, uh, you know, rare Legos or other toys or, or items, um, you know, what I would do is search for Lego uh, to show all Legos. Now, there's 43,000 results, but if we narrow it down to only Prime uh, and then look at the highest, most expensive ones. Now, um, you know, this one I think may be a little overpriced, but... Uh, this is definitely where uh, the Taj Mahal sells for, um, and this Carousel Creator, um, you know, these two items are probably the most, uh, some of the most sought after um, Legos. Uh, now, I know that, uh, you know, this does sell for this price, and this definitely sells for this price. The Taj Mahal is the, um, 
most pieces for a regular Lego set. So this is the, um, the largest set you can buy. Um, very rare and hard to find. Um, I, I've searched for this recently, so I know this isn't on um, on Craigslist anywhere in the U.S. Um, now, uh, the Lego Creator Carousel, um, I haven't searched for this, but we can do that right now. And uh, all we have to do is, I, you see I selected it, and we're just going to right-click and go down to Context Menu Search and go down to search Tempest. Now you can search on uh, on Craigslist. I'm in Tampa so uh, I made the settings for the Tampa Craigslist um, which I doubt there'd be anything here. Um, it didn't find it so it's just showing uh, random local items. Uh, so if we go back and uh, use context menu search again, see it's still highlighted, and then just click on search Tempest. Search Tempest will search every uh, Craigslist listing um, under whatever uh, settings you set up. So uh, if we change this, go all the way to the bottom, we can change this to any um, amount of miles um, in sale and wanted, of course, and we're going to search uh, all of Craigslist. Now it does have advertisements and, and things like that, but if it doesn't find anything, now look, we already found one result. Um, if we, it doesn't find anything, it's just going to uh, continue, and it found no results, so it just kept closing those locations. Your sponsored links, and it looks like there's some more pages. Let's go ahead and open this up in a new tab. And here we are. Here's our Lego Grand Carousel, $960, uh, located in Georgia. And you see there it is. Now if we go back and look, uh, if we open the listing, We can see the cheapest used is $2,600. That guy's selling it for $960. Uh, so we can see the, the new price spikes up and, uh, you know, occasionally drops down. Um, the rank. So we can see that they are selling. Um, one, two three, four, and the rank um, right now uh, is right where it is, so it hasn't had a recent sale. So since November, uh, four of these have sold, even at these uh, ridiculously high prices. Um, the used price does uh, fluctuate a little bit, but still, uh, you'll still double your money, you know, if you can buy it around that price, and, uh, you know, who knows, there may even be uh, more of these. Uh, so let's go to the next page. It'll search the closest to you and then continue to um, move out. See the mileage just keeps uh, growing. And it looks like that's uh, about it for the Lego carousel, um, but you can see how useful this product would be uh, for you. So, um, you know, I'm sure you can find a ton of great uses for this. Uh, you just, um, you know, it just takes a little, little bit of work, and uh, it's it's makes things super fast and super easy. And uh, if you want to try it out, it's under ten bucks uh, for the whole thing. So, um, you know, you check out the description, uh, I'll, I'll have the link to, um, to buy it, and, <clears throat> and that's about it. Thanks for watching.